God is good all the time. All the time, God is good. If you are not wearing green, you get pinched. Father Ogama here is not, is not wearing green, so please don't pinch him. Uh, today, we are celebrating the optional memorial of uh, St. Patrick. During the time of Lent, we don't celebrate, uh, we usually not, don't celebrate uh, memorials, and that's why you see today we continue to celebrate uh, Wednesday uh, of uh, fourth week of Lent. But it is St. Patrick. I can see some of you with green, and maybe I was saying, oh, maybe they are afraid to be pinched. You will see me with my black a little bit uh, after this mass, and please don't pinch me. Is any one of you in the past been told, stay out of trouble? I want to see that. Anybody has been told, stay out of trouble? Okay, I can see uh, over 80%. But what made us in trouble? Jesus today in the gospel is in trouble. Why? Because he broke the Sabbath. But also he called himself the son of a father. He called God his own father. What did he do on Sabbath? He healed people. He did good things on Sabbath, and that puts him in trouble. It is kind of what happened to St. Patrick. He was kidnapped, and he has been a slave in an island, and then he managed to escape. But when he was back in his home, home country, he had a vision, and he was told to go back to the place he was kidnapped. So he went back to be in trouble. When he was there back, he was very good changing things and preached the gospel. He later on became priest and bishop. So we see what made them in trouble. Jesus was in trouble because he did good things on the Sabbath. You and I sometimes are in trouble. What is it that makes us in trouble? What is it? Is it by doing good things? And if it is by doing good things you are in trouble, are you going to stop it? Jesus didn't stop. He kept doing good things. And actually before this reading, you remember yesterday gospel, he just healed somebody who was lying on the mat for 38 years. He healed him. And today, again, he healed another one, and he's in trouble. Are we stopping to do good things when we are in trouble? But also, what is it that makes us in trouble? If we are in trouble because of doing good things, thank God and ask for more courage to continue doing good. But if we are in trouble because of we have done bad things, uh -uh, we have to say sorry to God and change our life to be good. God is good all the time. All the time, God is good.